listen, I don't know what's going on with this Kyrie Irving. I guess people just have nothing else to report, and they got to throw in Kyrie Irving's name every 10 minutes to make something just valid, I guess. Because I'm trying to figure out, even in my own brain, because it don't make sense to me. It's like, why does anybody want to mention Kyrie Irving in a negative light? It's like, are you serious? Kyrie Irving now is what they say. He didn't talk to people, his teammates in the playoffs. <laughs> For like four, four days, he didn't speak to his teammates. It's like, what? One day he came in, he did. I'm quite sure he's done that plenty of times when he came in there before and needed to get in the zone. And then now they were making it like it sound like it came from the finals, the NBA finals, which it did not. It came from the actual, um, after they beat Indiana and went to play Toronto. <laughs> That's where it came from. So the fact that they even bring this up it, it's like a moot point. They swept Toronto. Matter of fact, he killed Toronto. So it's like, what what other point and reason do you have for making this an issue? Oh, I get it. <laughs> you want to villainize Kyrie Irving and make LeBron James the hero. Hats off, everyone. Hats off. We get it. Good job. Good job. Now, when you hear things like that, it, it kind of puts you in a um, situation where you look at it and say, how screwed up is the league if you see Fox, ESPN, the NFL, the NBA, every sporting news place that reports on sports are reported about this. And they're reporting about the same subject over and over again. Kyrie, watch. They got a BQE stakeout <laughs> for Kyrie Irving to see what happens with him. It is ridiculous. Now, of course, they got to do something now. Nobody's thinking, like, how did this get out to the press? Kyrie Irving didn't leak this news out to the press. He did everything behind closed doors. Who do you think leaked all this information out to the press? Um, uh, Let's see. Uh, LeBron. LeBron James. LeBron James is the one that leaked all this information out to the public. Yet and still, yet and still, everyone acts as if he's the good guy. Why would Kyrie want to get away from him? No one ever thought about that. No one ever took time to, to go over to that notion. Okay. All right, it's all Kyrie. <laughs> and y'all act like I come up with this. This is all over your news. Man, you just hating on LeBron. No. Your news, they're the one feeding you with this. They keeping this up. They're the reason I got to sit here and make these videos. I'm responding to this nonsense. Because I'm the only one with an objective point of view. You guys are all stuck on LeBron. And I'm like, he the one that leaked this out to the press. Y'all forgot that Dan Gilbert, whatever, the owner, knew about this for weeks? After he sat down with Kyrie, before Kyrie went to China? It was two weeks before anybody knew anything. So y'all can take it for what it is, but... That's really just the gist of it. And I think it's a shame. The man that won y'all a championship, the man that closed out Toronto, the man that, <laughs> I mean, what do you want from Kyrie Irving than what he's already given you? 
And do you think your team would be any better without him? That's the bigger question. I'm out.